Hey guys, this is Developer Dude, and in the previous video, we have written JavaScript code for this section. But in this video, we will create this section and write JavaScript for this section. And this is our final of this website. So let's get started. First, create a div with class name triangle. And now create another div with class name hidden sign. Okay. Now create another class, another div with class name hdn zero, and create a div h3. Write h3 and your lists, your lists, and now create a ul tag. You will tag in this white tag and write create a list. Okay. Now create another div. Another div and control Z with the class name HDN line hidden line. Okay. Now create another div with class name no any class name just create a div and write there h3 your account your account and uh, now create a ul tag and create list items write there account okay i created this list and control save control save this let's check this out here It's not showing anywhere. So now write the CSS code for this. Start writing dot triangle, targeting the triangle. Okay, triangle. Position absolute. Z index one zero one. And write one eight eight pixel. Top forty two pixel. Background color. So I'm just writing it fastly. So here this is, you can see the code. Because we will write JavaScript. So just doing it fast. Okay. Now width and everything display, none remove this. Control save. Control R for refresh. So here is this, this is our list, and this is here our triangle. This is our triangle. So let's <coughs> write this CSS code for design. So dot hdn sign and write position absolute. Oh mask position name. Position absolute and z index one zero one transition. All to set width 500 pixel height 350 pixel top 65 pixel then write 80 pixels background color white and border radius 5 pixel save refresh and here it is so you can see this triangle is here but in this the triangle is here so we have to change the location of the triangle so 42 pixels sorry refresh and now it is at his position okay so here it is now design this so let's write the CSS code dot hdn table display flex justify content space between and the story space around space around and the padding 20 pixel and zero now dot <coughs> sdm table h3 font size 16 pixel padding 10 pixel 0 
dot htdm table li color rgb 84 84 84 84 okay now font size 20 pixel and padding 5 pixel 0 cursor point okay dot hdm line width 0 0.5 pixel color black okay background color rgb 190 190 190 height 300 pixel control save Okay, I'll check this out. So here it is. Now write JavaScript code. So open our script and write the JavaScript code. So <coughs> create a const. Const is equal to mm, sign document dot query selector dot ac. Control C, Control V, again Control V. Now change the class to Triangle. Change this to Tree, and change this to Sign-in. Change the class to HDN Sign. Okay. Now add Event Listener. To the sign, sign dot add when listener click. Now let dot class list dot toggle toggle with active one. Control C. Now sign in. Control V. Control C and for sign in now free. Control V. Okay, save it. There will be no change because we have to write the JavaScript or CSS code for this. So check this out. Where is the HDN sign? So right there. Just do it. None. Okay. And uh, <coughs> free display. None. Okay. Black. So add the black. Dot black. Dot active. One now write the active one so mm, top 70 pixel down and width 100 percent. Okay. Now dot hdn sign with dot triangle with it. dot active display. <coughs> Next to the block. Dot triangle. Dot active. Display. Block. Control save. Now check this out. Okay, it's on there. Now again, change the Z index. Z index to 199. Okay, control save refresh now here it is now create another class dot stop I'm creating so here is this class and now right here document body dot class list dot add stop scroll Paste here, stop scroll, stop scroll, and now get back to the website, refresh it. Now scrolling is stopped, it's not scrolling. If you like this video, then subscribe to the channel, and if you want this also, link in the description.